What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Holding the Road. Mr. Gray Fox, my man, man, uh, Big Bad Harold. What's going on with y'all now? Today, we're going to be looking at a video about what not to do when you encounter the law. Because I want to give him the right title. You can't say police officers. True. Uh, you, uh, authority. You know, yeah, just yeah, yeah, the yeah, authority. Yeah. When you encounter the law. Yeah. Uh this this is what not to do. So uh let's let's check this out. Hey, stop the f car. Stop! What? What? You stay here? No. What are you doing here? No. Why does it matter? Turn the car off. Turn the car off now. Turn the car off now. Turn the car off. Turn the car off now. Hey! What you doing about punch on your Don't ever forget that. I'll punch you in your car. Hey! Let me know. Let me No, let me explain to you what we're doing. Put your hands on me and I don't say much. I don't give a I'm responding to an alarm call. Put your I didn't turn up on you. Turn around. Watch your turn around. Oh, my mama. Nobody's I under arrest. Stop Stop me. Turn around. Turn the turn around. Ma'am, turn around. Stop you're not touching under, me. You're not under arrest. I don't arrest. care. You came in this car style. Don't you ever put your hands on me. I'll spit arrest. on you. Stop you're not under arrest. Stop. 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 Stop.
The next what? officer, she's still at it. No, what the f are you doing? I gotta do your job. Stop pressing on me. Stop not pressing on me. Like, we're already Listen. Come on. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. No, 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 no. Don't speak to me, man. Slammed her out of the car. Slammed her on her outside of the car, bro. And they still over here when we over here. We ain't out right now, bro. There's so much shit that was up in that. Yeah. About what not to do when. uh Confronted by officers. Hold on a second. When when you're dealing with the authority, well, cops, you get what I'm saying. Initially, he was wrong. Oh yeah, right. Oh yeah. You wouldn't have done that to anybody else. No. It's not even safe to do that to anybody else if you're a police officer. Yeah. You don't stick your head in somebody in, in just a random person's car. No. You know what I mean? And and turn the, the key off. Far as he know that if it was some trouble going on, on over there, somebody could have been in the back seat. He put himself in harm's way. You understand yeah, what I'm saying? He put himself in, yeah. in harm's way. Yeah, he did. But where she messed up, all right, if you ain't got nothing going on, yeah. hey, it ain't no time to show this man how bad you is because no. you ain't bad. Huh. This girl could have died, bro. Easily, she could have got killed in this climate. Easily, easily she could have. She got. She could have got killed. Yep, and never got to tell her story. And anybody that's out there listening right now, this this is the whole point of this video. Don't fuss. Don't fight, and don't flee. Not saying that that's going to save your life. Yeah, but that's going to give you the best results. Yeah. He was wrong initially. He was. But why not you be there to fight that in court? You save all that smoke and all that energy for when you go to court. Yes. Or when you go to talk to somebody. See, the problem is when we have complaints, we really don't even know who to go talk to. We don't even know who to complain to. But we, we gotta we gotta get a lawyer, go mm -hmm. find a lawyer, right? Uh -huh. And he got to review your case and be like, well, is there anything here for me to get paid? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And if it, if it's a way for me to get paid, I'll show you the way for you to get paid. You understand what I'm saying? And not necessarily even justice. Yeah. I'm finna show you how to get paid. You understand what I'm saying? Now, he'll be out there doing the same shit. See? Because really, he started that, but he didn't start that. Because he told her to stop, stop the car, and she come off with, "What does that matter? What you know?" Now you didn't piss him off. He feel like you didn't came at him wrong. He don't respect you at all. No, he don't. He ain't got no respect for you. That's why he reached his head in the car, and he turned the car. Off. You understand what I'm saying? Which he should not have done. But in return, you should not have reacted the way you react. You could not match his energy. That ain't what you do. See, because if you would have gotten, if she would have gotten herself killed, she gave the media so much material. To justify why he did. You understand what yeah. I'm saying? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And make it look like she was wrong. And, and that's what I was going to say. It's just our young folks need to understand what not to do and what to do in that situation. He came off wrong, coming to you to say, "Hey, hey, stop the car, stop the car." Okay, officer, why are you why are you stopping? Mm -hmm. I had a disturbance, blase, blase, blase. You calmly mm -hmm. tell him, "Well, look, uh, that wasn't me. Uh, what else you got for?" Me? And if he mm -hmm. would have said, "Hey, can you oh, yeah. the car and search my car?" Hey, let him do it. If yeah. you're clean, go ahead and let him. Even if you yeah. hear, let yeah. him do it. Oh yeah, you know oh yeah, just go yeah. and let him do it, man. Oh yeah, because yeah. all that hostility she just showed, like you said, it almost justified him to her. Or yeah. put a tase on her, put his yeah. hands on the rough. Oh, right? yeah. But oh, I yeah. applaud him for correcting his wrong. That that was that yeah. right there was a good example of the cops trying to be better. You yeah. know what I'm saying? All yeah. three of them actually was trying to be better. I calm. think I think he realized that he fucked up. He did. He did. And he had to be calm because initially, mm -hmm. you understand what I'm saying? He, was dead he, should, he shouldn't have put his head in that damn car. No. He, no. He, but it also looked like she was trying to roll the Run. Ain't it like she was trying to hurry up and leave? You get you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, yeah, so, yeah. so like I say, 
if it had would have went all the way left and this girl would have been dead yeah. you understand what i'm saying and she would have got killed they gonna look through that video and find detail to try to justify that cop's action Any and, type of grace. and, yeah. and unfortunately she gave them Everything. just Everything so much so much material yeah so yeah. much material yeah and that's why i'm saying you know what i'm saying look don't be out there trying to prove to somebody how bad you oh, are because you see, a lot that. of that a lot of that was showing off it was it was a lot of that was showing off you know what i'm saying you got some people there and it was two more people in the car you know what i'm saying they looked like they was a, a, yeah, yeah. a bit younger and they just walked on off into the house they did they did you understand what i'm saying hey, man look here i ain't even got time for this right here and you know what i'm saying she went from zero to one thousand you get what i'm saying yes. you either showing off or you got some serious anger issues mm -hmm. and you might need some medicine because that almost got you killed almost, that almost got, got you killed, killed. all almost that killed. all that jibber jabber you cannot verbally assault a cop because that's exactly what he could have put on that now, whether he did that or not we'll get more information but all that you was doing it called for him to slam you throw you around whatever he wanted to do because you act is way too aggressive for no reason no reason Initially, all that but all that on my mama, mama. Yeah. I'm gonna kick the yeah, I'm gonna spit on you. Know you. I'm, you know, I, I hope you keep your kids die and all this other shit I'm right here. Take your job and all this crazy stuff, man. I don't need all that, man. If that had been one of these old cops that want to do dirt, that want that smoke, that want oh, yeah. that smoke, oh yeah, you would have gave him a reason. Oh, you understand yeah. what I'm saying? And we ain't even feeling like fake and pretend like they're not out there. There's plenty of them. Plenty of them. Oh, yeah. You see what I'm saying? And see, we always talking about, you know, you have people even come back and, and may criticize us for trying to tell, you know, Jits uh, or anybody. A better really. way. A better you understand way. what I'm saying? Yeah. Dude, right. Oh, man, you know what I'm saying? You scared, you scared, you scared. No, man. You understand what I'm saying? Look, you just trying to survive the encounter. So, look, if somebody's fighting for me, or, or, or speaking for me in my name, mm -hmm. I want to be present. Oh yeah, you understand what I'm saying? I want. Hey, look here, this lawyer is speaking about me. What he did to me, I don't want to be. You know what I'm saying? And you know they, you know he going home, done took him a shower and ate him a good meal, and and his and his wife telling him everything gonna be okay. Meanwhile, your, your family, family planning your funeral, planning your funeral. You're damn right. Yeah. Yep. You understand what I'm saying? Everybody's sad. They got to come in. They trying to get money together and yeah. and and seeing what they can do for you and all this shit right here. Yeah. You know, because you don't know how to control yourself. And all I'm saying, don't fuss, don't fight, don't flee. I get that from Neely Fuller Jr. Yeah. You understand what I'm saying? Don't fuss, don't fight, don't flee. Good word. You know, but I just seen that video, man, and I was like, oh my God. This, yeah. that, I mean, and I'm, I'm going to be straight up honest with you. Had that been anybody else? Now, had, had that been one of them that wanted to, they would have got it and, and see my my honest opinion i would have got fed up with her man oh, like you doing all this i can't take that around. i ain't got i ain't got that type of patience you I'm know what i'm saying I, I'm, I'm trying yeah. my best to correct my wrong for opening yeah. up your door without giving oh, you yeah. all the information oh yeah but right oh, yeah. now you finna spit on me you finna hit me and all this oh yeah oh yeah like, do you not understand i got this badge oh, i yeah. got a license this is a license to kill if i want oh yeah right here Oh yeah, okay. and ain't nobody gonna do nothing. Ain't nobody. You gonna understand what I'm saying? And and from what you're doing, everybody gonna say, "Hey, look here, I understand." Yeah, exactly. You know what I mean? Exactly. So yeah, man. I mean, I, I get that, but believe me, I don't have that type of patience. You know what I'm saying? That's why I'm not a, a police officer. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. But something else though, Harold. See, because people talk about they demonize the the profession of law enforcement. They do. There are some crooked, dirty, rotten ass cops out there that don't even need to be nowhere near a police department. True, true. But you cannot demonize the profession of law enforcement. Law enforcement is needed. Yeah. Especially in our community. Everybody hates cops until they need one. Oh, yeah. They you are. understand what I'm saying? Yeah. I think we, and me and you done talked about this plenty of times that we need more people that look like us to uh uh serve and protect us in law exactly. enforcement exactly but we've demonized the profession the way well, everybody feel there. like they yeah, they don't want to go into go the there. profession oh, yeah. yep. you get what i'm saying yep. so it's like damn we we do need more good black cops mm -hmm. in the black community 
that know how to deal. Yeah, I, but I don't think anybody could deal with that. No, no. You understand no, what I'm saying? No. I mean, that take a maximum level of patience. And the reason why he had that patience is because he know he fucked up. He messed up. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah he messed he up. Fucked oh, up. Yeah. He fucked yeah, up. He fucked up. He know he fucked up. Oh, he yeah. know he messed yeah. up. Yep. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? But uh hey, I know me and you both got things to do. You understand what I'm saying? And we wanted to bring this this to y'all, let y'all check this out about what not to do when you're approached by a cop. Yes. So called police officer. You and understand what I'm saying? Survive the encounter. That's that's survive the encounter. Some of the best advice, simple advice to remember. Is don't fuss, don't fight, don't flee. Don't flee. Do not flee. Don't make the situation worse than it has to be. Be the bigger man, woman in that situation. Calm yourself as much as possible. Because you got you want to be able to tell your story. Mm-hmm. You got you want to be able That's to tell absolutely your story. right. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You tell your side of the story. That's somebody uh telling somebody else what happened or whatever. You know mm-hmm. what I mean? You be there to tell your side of the story. Yes, sir. But that's what it is, man. As always, y'all live right. Play fair. I'll let it. I'll let it, man. All right.